Brendan Fraser and the cast of The Mummy are back with a sequel and a lot of new adventure. So Hollywood.com has your exclusive look now at The Mummy Returns. To experience the adventure that will never die. There's no replacing Indy. Uh, I think we all defer to Indy. Indy. <laughs> Indy is, Indy is up there. Rick McConnell's down here. It, it, Indy's up there. Honey, what you doing? These guys don't use doors. The support has been tremendous, which, uh, which obviously you know, makes me feel fantastic and very humbled, especially uh, you know, having the support of, of guys in the action genres, uh, from Nicolas Cage to Stallone to, of course, Arnold, who's been fantastic. I mean, what kinds of things do you hear from Arnold? He said, Rock, you're doing fantastic. You keep up the good work. Um, basically, uh, just very proud and, uh, and, and doing great and just keep up the good work. Ah! For me, it was a big honor. I mean, it certainly taught me that no matter how little things are that you do in life, you should always do them the best you can because you never know what can happen. And that goes for anybody in any profession. Do you fear any of the little critters? I do have a bit of a phobia about beetles, actually, as it happens, which is because of the scarab beetles and all that was sort of funny. But two things, one was like when I was a kid, I had this big beetle down my back one time and it bit me. And the other thing was as a student, I lived in this flat which was kind of infested with cockroaches because it was above a baker's. And they're kind of like crunchy and stuff and like, Ew. It's just fun to watch the audience and jump out of their seats and they scream and then they all laugh. There's, you know, gets a lot of great laughs, a lot of great screams. And what surprised me, I guess, over the last few screenings is how many times the audience just burst into cheers. I mean, that's really, you know, that's magic. Did you know the first film would do as well as it did? I can tell you from just working on the set with the most wonderful people that we worked with and the enjoyment that everybody had from working on that movie, the general feeling was this is a great thing. This is a success. It has to be. The failure rate, I'm told, is, um, is like 80%. Only 20% of sequels do better than the first ones. And uh, so, you know, we've got the odds against us, but I've seen the movie and it's going to be amazing. It's always a challenge to create a sequel, I think, that will meet the expectations that an audience hopes for, especially one that was as well received as, thankfully, this one was. Um, there were some, some errors in logic in the first film that could be improved on, and thankfully we've been able to take advantage of that with the second one. The Mummy Returns.